Well, initial estimates put the rate of oil spilling into the Gulf of Mexico at 5,000 barrels a day. Now, a Purdue professor's research shows that number could be a lot higher. Nicole Kahn has the story. Associate Professor of Mechanical Engineering Steve Worley looked at this recently released video of oil flowing into the Gulf of Mexico. Then he used an established technique called particle image velocimetry to estimate the flow of oil into the water. We take a, a succession of pictures, uh, a video. If we, we may take a video and then take it apart into um, several or even hundreds or thousands of pictures. And then we compare what the picture looks like in one frame to what it looks like in a subsequent frame. He crunched the numbers and found the estimate of 5,000 barrels a day leaking into the Gulf was low. Approximately 10 times as much oil should be in the Gulf as, uh, as previously thought. His estimate is 70,000 barrels a day. The measurement could range anywhere from 56,000 barrels per day up to 84,000 barrels per day. But it was something besides those larger numbers that surprised him. I'm surprised with the number of people working on this problem that uh, one guy working on his own uh, in an afternoon is able to come up with a number that, uh, that the BP engineers couldn't. He believes that changes how the leak could potentially be plugged and the scale of cleanup efforts. Nicole Kahn, News Channel 8.